All right, so we got another leak code for you here. Uh, this is 1281, subtract the product and sum of digits of an integer. All right, so it says, given an integer n, return the difference between the product of its digit and the sum of its digits. So basically they're gonna give us this integer here um, and then we are going to uh, get the, the product, so multiply them each digit and then we're also going to get the sum. So add each digit together and then subtract those two like this. So I think this should be fairly straightforward. Um, we'll see, I got a way to do this with a reduce. I don't know if that will be uh, the fastest possible way, but let's uh, check it out. So the first thing we wanna do with the N here is to um, split it up. So make it a, an array here. And uh, in order to do that, we have to turn these uh, the n, which is a number right now, into a string. So let's say uh, let str, and then we'll say equal to n dot string, uh, n dot uh, two string, like that. And then we're gonna split that up like that, and we'll just split it at each uh, number like that. All right. And then what we're gonna do here is we're gonna get a, a multiply and a add and then uh, in separate variables and then subtract the add from the multiply. So how, we, how we're gonna do that is like this. We're gonna say let uh, multiply like this and we will say str.reduce. So this is the reduce function in JavaScript. And we're gonna say a and b like this. And then here we're gonna return uh, a times B, but in order to do that right now, we have them as strings. So we got to turn them into ints again. So we're going to say parse int like that, and that'll be of A. And then we'll say it times and we'll say it parse int. Let's uh, move this over. Oh no, that won't work of uh, B here like this. All right, maybe I'll make this a little smaller actually, so we can see this. Hopefully you can still see this. Uh, parse int of b like that, and that is gonna be our multiply. Now, if we copy this down here, like this, we can change this to add, and we can change this to uh, addition, like this, and hopefully, when we return down here, uh, like this, and we will say multiply minus add, like this. All right, so hopefully this works. Let's check it out. All right, so that was accepted and let's try submitting it. All right, so that looks like it worked and it wasn't uh, super slow. It says faster than 75% of uh, these submissions. So that seems good and uh, I'll see you in the next one.